Hello and welcome back to the channel. You're tuned in to the real estate market. Here we discuss everything that has to do with Ghana's real estate space, the ups, the downs. We navigate everything and then feed it back to you. Today I'm seated with the head of marketing for Royal Kingdom Estate, Mr. Yamoa. Hi, Mr. Yamoa. Hi, Ajoa. I want you to tell us a little bit more about you know your position at RKA. I think two words will sum it up. I'm, okay. the, I'm the head of sales and marketing. Okay. That's where I can do best it. So that's, I think that sums up everything yeah, up. Yeah, that's, that's amazing. So what I want us to discuss today is um, Ghana's real estate outlook. What in a few, in a few words, okay. how would you sum up the whole thing? Currently, I would say we are experiencing rapid development okay. in terms of the real estate. We are having especially residential, but there's also the upspring of mixed use okay. where we are having uh, property developers come up with buildings that are residential purposes and okay. then commercial, commercial pur purposes. purposes, exactly. And also there's um, development is, is being extended to um, further places because okay. of urbanization, oh. right? So you would even realize that the diaspora, so people in the diaspora are very much comfortable purchasing lands that's far from the city exactly out of the urban yeah, area so yeah. when 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 this happens it tells you that development is not far fetched when okay. you're buying land in these areas mm -hmm. you get it so the and, and actually the the expected growth of real estate i think about um in 2026 there about is mm -hmm. is projected at about five points of the percent okay so it tells you that there's so much uh, um, potential over right. there even the global value of real estate you're looking at trillions of dollars right it keeps and skyrocketing exactly so the the outlook of real estate in ghana okay. there's a surge in development basically right. there's also and you can look at it in two ways okay. there's the focus on the experts there's the focus on the the da those the diaspora, the diaspora there's yeah. a focus on those who want their largest yeah. properties and okay. there's also the focus on those who are looking out for the affordable housing, housing. in fact some people are even now doing just the flipping okay. so they get the properties that need renovation mm -hmm. they flip some of the old homes yes yeah. they just flip it and then oh. they're doing um rentals and all okay. that so basically there's an there's an uprising of a lot of development I projects see. ongoing that is what's happening okay. there's a mixed use there's a residential that's what's happening and urbanization is also forcing development in other places where previously you wouldn't have even considered to okay. buy properties or yeah. lands over there yes yeah. the advice is that when you have the opportunity to buy land regardless of where it is mm -hmm. buy, Just it buy it because you think know, that's very important it's the fundamental yeah. it's, it's, it's the basic mm -hmm. of real estate because some time back if if you had told somebody to buy a land at Spintex, maybe they live somewhere in the central region, they'll be telling, oh, it's too far, or like, you know, but now yes. we have all of these de uh, developments, places yes. are opening up, people yes. are moving in, it's it's yes. it's going up. So yes. you'd advise them to get land no matter where yes. it is. Yes, land is the basic commodity when it comes to real estate. Right. So once you have the opportunity to go in for land, get it. Whether you are going to develop it now mm -hmm. or later, exactly. once you have the means, go in for it. Mm -hmm. So basically that's the outlook of, of real estate in mm -hmm. Ghana. It's it's really on the rise. I see. On the global market and in Ghana, okay. it's really on the rise. All right, so tell us a little bit about, you know, some of the trends that are ongoing. The trends, mm -hmm. I believe, are what I literally, or basically just touched on. Okay. The kind of development. We are seeing a lot of high-rise buildings. Okay. That also tells you the management of space or land. Right. Because previously, where we had those, um, the compound houses yeah. where, you know, big compounds. <laughs> yeah. And, but now, you see a lot of high-rise buildings mm -hmm. and even the parking lots are underground. Yeah. It tells you that there is, you know, some sort of innovation mm -hmm. in even real estate. We are seeing people going for smart homes mm -hmm. and all that. Yes. So, you know, um, when it comes to the, the, the trends, mm -hmm. in incorporating technology, right. the efficient use of space, right. 
all these things are part of the trends okay. and even when it comes to the rentals okay. how people are going about it now there's now the reit as the rate okay. which is also on the rise that's real estate, real estate investment, investment trust. trust yeah now it's allowing people to make money from real estate right. without directly owning and managing their properties yeah. right so there are some known companies out there okay. that is what they do maybe to the ordinary person out there they, they don't know this is what they yes. are doing but a lot of companies are actually doing involved. that and a lot of investors have also come to understand you know how to make money from it without necessarily being there being physically involved, so yeah. that is also something on the on the on the rise when you're looking at the, yeah. the trends here yeah. so basically in a scope to put it in a few words that's what is happening on the I market see. okay yeah. and then finally the forecast i am i i believe or well, from projections yeah there's going to be rapid development in i wouldn't say rural areas but locations outside urban areas okay just because of the the rate at which purchases are going, are going. on at such places there's going to be rapid development over there. There are going to be a lot of high-rise buildings, mm -hmm. also because of um, the efficient use of space. space yeah. Yes, there's 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 going to be more of the REITs yeah. because investors are also coming through. Yeah. Um. There's also going to be, uh, what I would call, you know, the flipping, mm -hmm. because people are doing that as well. Yeah. So the forecast is, is is that there's so much potential there's so much value it's just going to increase okay. and keep increasing and keep and going keep up increasing. so yeah, you'd so. advise people to get on board with yes, real estate, yes, yes. especially I mean, in ghana especially in ghana i mean if you look at ghana now people come to ghana and they are amazed especially those who haven't been here before yes. and those who have not been here in a long while yes if to, even you in ghana you go to certain parts of ghana where yeah. you've not been in a while Whenever you go there, you see the change, yes. you see the development. So on a daily. that tells you that real estate is, I feel like real estate is a must right. for everyone. And when I say it's a must, I'm not saying you need to acquire millions before you put up a high rise building. Mm -hmm. But like someone started with, uh, two friends started with the Airbnb. Yes, and now you can it's also, a global thing. You can also come up with something. Yeah, You get it. There's crowdfunding. There are a lot of things that people get into into doing yeah. when it comes to real estate mm -hmm. to make make mm -hmm. um some money or if you see have a stake in it yeah. so we are all stakeholders right whether tenant or landlord we are always yeah. <laughs> somewhere somehow yeah involved. yeah when we say someone is a stakeholder a stakeholder is someone who is one way or the other involved in yeah. it whether you are being affected by it or you are part of the, yeah. the decision making mm -hmm. so we are all stakeholders right. so let's take advantage of the the forecast right. and position ourselves so okay and take advantage of whatever is going on. All right. Well, thank you so much for thank having you, the Adra. time with me, guys. I hope you've enjoyed this. Let me know your opinion on the show. Is there anything you'd like to hear about? Are there certain areas you want us to touch on? You know that at RKE, we are always you know, here and available to answer your questions and feed you the knowledge. So do subscribe to the channel, share the video, like it. We'll see you in the next video. Mm -hmm.